I'm here to give you a very important message. I'm here to give you a message about food. Food is not what you think it is. Hi everyone, my name is James Marin. I'm a holistic registered dietitian, environmental nutritionist, author, speaker, and diabetes expert. I'm here to tell you about food, okay? Because food for many of us is our friend that comforts us. It's our stress reliever, right? It's a social aspect of our lives where we get together and we have yummy food with family or friends, right, during holidays. Food is something that tastes good. Food is something that helps us lose weight or put on weight or you name it, right? But I'm here to tell you something deeper about food. I want you to understand the true meaning of food, okay? Many of you know this, okay? but. I want to make sure you know this. I want to remind you, okay? Because food is there to nourish you. That's why it's called nutrition, right? It's nutrients. It's there to make sure that each cell in your body is thriving and surviving, okay? A good sign you're not getting your nutrition is if you have a disease, okay? All a disease means is dis-ease. Instead of being at ease, you are not at ease, okay? Whether that's a certain organ or your blood or your entire body, which is called fibromyalgia, right? Or diabetes, right? Where your pancreas is in a dis-ease state. Disease, right? Okay, so what can we do? Well, again, you have to understand why food is there. Food is there to nourish you. So I want you to look at your food and say, is this food going to nourish me? Does this food have nutrition, okay? Chances are, and why do health professionals, and you hear it in public health or you hear it from nutritionists, eat the rainbow, right? Eat all your colors. A good way to know your food has nutrition is if it has lots of natural colors. I'm not talking about artificial colors. I'm not saying go get a rainbow birthday cake, confetti cake, and ooh, lots of colors, eat it. No, natural colors, right? Okay, so you have to understand that everything you eat from your snacks or anything you drink, you know, again, your meals, breakfast, lunch, dinner, you wanna look at that food and say, is it giving me the nutrition I need? Is it gonna feed my cells? Is it gonna help me to regenerate? What do I mean by that? Well, on average, our cells in our entire body will regenerate every seven years, okay? They have a certain lifespan. Just like when we, you know, rub off some dead skin, if you exfoliate your face or you have a loofah in the shower and you're rubbing off dead skin, just in the same way our skin cells die, every single cell in our body will die and it replicates, okay? That's called mitosis, right? You go back to, you know, high school biology or middle school biology, it's called mitosis, it's cell replications. What do those cells replicate with? Our nutrition right? So without proper nutrition, you're not going to get a new healthy cell, okay? And this is on average, again, uh, the whole body replicates or all the cells have died and new ones are there about every seven years or so, okay? But again, this happens a lot quicker for our skin cells and liver cells. So uh, different cells in our body, you know, undergo mitosis at different times. But the point I'm making, guys, is food is not just there to comfort you. Food is not just there to be social and go out to eat. Food is not just there to help you reduce stress. Food is not just there to taste good, okay? But a bonus is that healthy food, nutrient-dense food can taste good. But most importantly, you want nutrient-dense food to help you know, with your cell regeneration. What does that mean? To help with your health, to help you live healthy, to help you thrive. And what's awesome, when you really get into this, when you really understand this, proper nutrition is not just gonna help your body, it's gonna help the environment, it's gonna help your family. It goes way deeper and it has this you know, huge effect that we can't even fully imagine, okay? So I challenge you to rethink food, okay? I want you to truly understand what food is. Food is there to nourish your body, that is why we eat. Okay, it's there to make sure you have your vitamins and minerals and phytonutrients and antioxidants and it helps support your enzymes for your cells and all these chemical reactions going on in your amazing body. So you have an amazing body, you need amazing nutrition. Okay, so let's review. Food is not just there to taste good. Food is not just there to help ease your stress. Food is not just there when you're going out and for holidays and things like that. 
food, most importantly, number one, the very top is to give you nutrition. It's to nourish your body, okay? So I hope you understand that. I hope this helps you making better choices and understanding, you know, what to do or how to how to kind of look at food and give you this better consciousness about food, okay? Now, I want to give you something I give to my patients all the time, okay? This is going to be a shopping guide and it gives you 101 foods to avoid. This is completely free. Click below, get your free copy of a awesome shopping guide. It is for diabetics, but also this can help you with weight loss. This is going to help you, you know, reduce inflammation. But most importantly, if you're pre-diabetic, type 2 diabetic, whether you're newly diagnosed or you've been diagnosed for 20 years, this is going to help you. This is your first start, understanding what to eat understanding what to avoid okay and right now this is absolutely free okay click the link below get your free copy don't wait to make changes don't wait to understand food better don't wait to be healthier thank you guys have a wonderful day i hope to see you soon